problem uh, chapter 6, number 39. And in this problem, we have a box um, which is moving at a spring, and I'm looking for the displacement in the spring. So um, these are all the givens in the problem. We've got the mass of the box, 6 kilograms. We've got the velocity of the box, which is traveling 3 meters per second. And then we've got a spring constant, which is 35 newtons per centimeter. And since that's not standard, I went ahead and changed it um, using this conversion to 7,500 newtons over meters. And um, the first thing I wanted to do, well, the problem asks you to use the work energy theorem, which we know is work equals the integral of kx dx. So you pull x out, you integrate it, you get this. Um, and then you want to solve for x. So then you get this. Um, so the first thing you do um, is you're going to want to get the work, so which I came over here. So we know that work equals 1 half mv. So if we plug in these values, we're going to get work equals 1 half times the mass, which is 6.0 kilograms. And then, uh, and then we have the velocity squared, which the velocity was 3 uh, meters per second. And that's squared. So when you multiply all this out, um, you get work equals 27 joules. And uh, because a joule is meters squared, seconds squared, times kilogram. So then we plug this in over here to get our displacement, and that's going to be x equals uh, 2 times uh, 27 joules all over 7,500 newtons. Uh, per meter, and um, that is going to come out to um, eight point five centimeters. Of course, it came out in um, meters first, but I converted it to centimeters.